In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the center cab light on this Chevy Silverado. These are wired into your headlights, so as soon as you flip on the parking lights or the headlights, these turn on. Uh, we're replacing just the center one because it's a slightly different process than the two side ones. So let's get started. For this, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver to remove the three Phillips head screws that hold this down. Next, I recommend a plastic trim tool so that you don't scratch up the paint and potentially cause a spot where it could rust. Obviously, the truck has already rusted in several places and this is a different issue. This will have to be addressed for the purposes of this video. I'm just gonna show you how to replace this light. But if your truck has these spots, definitely address them because it will rot through and will cause a leak on the inside of your vehicle. Take that trim tool and pop it up. There's nothing other than the pressure of the gasket holding this on. This one's really stuck apparently. Okay, this is the side with the wiring harness. We're gonna have to continue this up. This broke. I'm going to just leave it like this. I don't want to disconnect the wire yet so it doesn't fall inside. Otherwise, I'd have to go fish it through the uh, headliner. So I don't want to, I don't want to do that. I'm trying to avoid taking out interior pieces. I'm going to keep prying this. Make sure you don't damage the paint. It is very, very stuck on here. Okay. There's the rest of it. This adhesive was, well, quite strong. Peel all this off. And you want to make sure the surface is clean. At this point, you have two options. If your clips and your roof is in good condition, you don't necessarily have to take these out. You can just take the screws out of the new assembly and then pop these pieces out and not struggle to remove these. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do that in case you need to. Uh, but these can be reused if needed, just so you know. So at this point, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get these plastic pieces off of the metal clips. Okay, it looks like they came out as a, uh, together as an assembly, so that's good. Sometimes these split apart just like that, and then you have to end up fishing the metal part out without damaging the paint further. Last one on this side. Clearly this roof is in very poor condition. Take a, a rag or a paper towel, whatever you have, and just clean this area off so that you have the least amount of debris possible. I know it's scratching the paint, but it's not really visible, and uh, clearly this truck has bigger issues here on the roof. It needs to be repainted anyway. So I'm just trying to get all of this sand and debris off to get a nice, or <laughs> the best seal that I can out of this surface. At this point, let's grab a pocket screwdriver and pop this little clip up so we can unplug the light, the old light that is. Just like that. Don't let go of this cable. You don't want to lose it underneath the uh, roof here. Plug it into the new light, just like so. Now, line up all the clips, the tabs. You're gonna have to press that down like that. It should seat in place. And now take your Phillips head screwdrivers. The screws are already started in here. Hold downward pressure on it. Not gonna tighten them fully. I just wanna start them all and snug them and then once I get that last one in, I'll come back and fully tighten all of them so I can make sure that it's seated all the way. Sometimes these clips will pop out as you screw them in, so keep that in mind. That's fairly tight right there. And that one, and that one. 
Okay, we're ready to go. At this point, as long as your seal is seated and your roof is good, you should not have any water leaks. And uh, now you can test out your light and make sure it works. There you have it. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.